this is Dell laptop comes with Windows 11 somehow the start button doesn't work so what happens is when you click on start button it doesn't respond anything for example let me show you nothing does happen now the question is how to fix it there are a couple of ways to fix it and if you ask the reason why it happened is definitely because of the updates because Windows 11 it's quite fragile with the updates, right? Instead of to stop the service for start button and write another command to restart it, then it should be fixed. What about if the command doesn't work? What you should do? That's what I'm going to show you in this video. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get into the control panel. I'll try to get into update history. And from the history, we'll try to remove all the updates manually. By the way, if you delete the update, it shouldn't affect your personal data. I always would suggest you, because of this is Windows 11, quite fragile, keep your data back. That's the first thing. Once you have data backed up, you can delete all the updates and you can try. So I did try and everything is fine now. For example, as you can see here, if I click, it comes out. It's functional software glitch, okay? You don't have to be professional to solve this, so let's do that less than two minutes. So first of all, what you need to do, once you press OK, it's gonna come back to this page. From here, the bottom section, as you can see, it says Windows Update, click here. Once you click, then you're gonna find Update History. So obviously, you know when it stopped working. So what are you gonna do now? We're going to uninstall updates. We're going to click here. Once we do that, it's going to show us. And it's going to show us exactly when the install happened. As you can see, it shows 16.5.24. And that was 24 start. So we're going to delete the latest one, which is that one. And then we're going to try. If it doesn't work still, we're going to, um, we're going to uninstall the second one. Then still, if it doesn't work, we're going to install the third one. Restart required, so we're going to restart it. You can right click on the start menu, and then once you go to shutdown or sign out, you can hit on restart and it's going to restart. Still, it doesn't work, so we're going to take another update sound. No problem. Let's go to Task Manager, New Task, press OK. Update history, uninstall updates. We installed that one too. So we're going to delete all of them one by one. And it's not going to make any big changes anyway. And then we're going to restart it. And then it should be fine if this is because of the updates. But with Windows 11, from my experience, I found already 90% of them does happen because of the bad updates. So let's check this out. So we're going to restart it, get back to this point and check if the start button does work. All right. If I click, it comes out. 